last goddamn thing for me to worry about. You can pick it up on the way out. Hey, I'm doing? Buying rooms down in the cellar. This way. I ain't seen no line in this house before. Y'all's over in Georgia for a while. He just got out of the service. And my cousin's been trying to get on here for over a year now. Was in the Navy for two tours. Got medals falling out of his ass. Government tells him thanks, but no thanks. That's a crock of shit if I ever heard one. Sad day when a god fearing white man can't get a job. But that young nigga who staggers in is hiding on the spot. Nigga. That's racist. These bastards better not be playing with each other back there. <laughs> Fuck you! Christ, look at that. Didn't know y'all held that much gold. That Washington's been shuffling around on account of the war. It's here, then it gets sent to Dallas, then it comes back. It doesn't make a lick of goddamn sense. Here we are. Those bags on the table there. That's a lot of money. Done this detail before. Figured it'd be bigger. I guess the job done. Only time there's a problem is when the flu clogs up. Fuck. That's some heat right there. We used to use coal for it, but a year or so back we switched over to oil. Damn. Damn. God, that guy was an asshole. We need to move. Danny and Ellis should be coming up any time now. All right, give me a second. <clears throat> right, you take care of those guards. Keep your ass down. You don't want them getting a drop on us. I know what the fuck I'm doing. Ooh, nigga. You know that house we've been renting out? Called over there last night. Told them I wanted to sell it. Told them they needed to be out in two weeks. Man, my name's uh, John. Stop playing into me. Saying, huh? Huh? Kick the hornet's nest this time. Fuck! Come on, open! Give me that damn thing. What's this? Smoke don't be shit. Stay close to the Watch for the drill. I'll deal with these assholes. So Sammy had men all over the place. 
And one of them worked at a cleaner's and stole the uniforms Georgie Marcano and Lincoln Clay wore on the day of the robbery. Another one was a janitor at the Federal Reserve, and he provided a rough layout. The robbery of the Federal Reserve was timed perfectly, and none of it would have been possible without the involvement of Sammy Robinson, Lincoln Clay, and the rest of the black mob. You just come from Vietnam? That's right. I was a Marine in the Pacific. You take it from me. Just because you're home doesn't mean you're back. You understand? People around here, they don't... They don't get it. Never will. Keep your ass out of trouble. Don't worry about it. Excuse me, sir. I'm looking for my stepbrother, Lincoln Clay. You seen him? If you used to get taked off if you were even a minute late. Kiss my ass. There he is. <laughs> <laughs> How was the trip? Be as how this is the first time in four years and somebody telling me where to go, what to do, or how to do it. It was fucking great. <laughs> mm. What's new with the old man? Man, don't even get me started on Pops. He used to pull his head out of his head. Same as ever then. Brother, you have no fucking idea. Damn, Ellis. She's looking good. <laughs> Just like I left her. Man, even I know not to fuck around with your car. Mm. All right, come on. I'm ready to go home. <laughs> Since we got your telephone. Damn, this back in the paint. I gotta go, guys. I'll be screaming later.